America has huge blind spots when it comes to Chinese tech. Some of it makes sense. A language barrier, separate social media ecosystems, and a shrinking number of foreign reporters actually in China give Americans very limited visibility to some of the most exciting innovations happening there. But there are other reasons the U.S. is continually caught off guard. The deep seek shock we saw is underpinned by a false sense of exceptionalism and xenophobia. Let me explain what I mean. Silicon Valley has no shortage of innovators or inflated egos. U.S. tech leaders paint themselves as the only visionaries who can predict the future, and investors often reward them whether their ideas come true or not. DeepSeek upended this narrative with a double whammy. It not only proved AI breakthroughs could happen at a fraction of the cost, but also despite the web of export controls aimed at holding China back. Unlike Silicon Valley, China's tech entrepreneurs want to stay out of the spotlight, especially in the wake of a government crackdown on tech power. It's a reminder that Chinese tech doesn't necessarily thrive because of top-down government support, but in spite of it. There are more than one billion people in China. The sheer market size alone makes the scale of its tech industry enormous and local competition fierce. So, what do all these factors create? A dichotomy. One in which U.S. tech elites have become household names, while the world knows very little about the brilliant Chinese minds churning out internet gold. And despite the U.S.'s best efforts, Chinese apps are getting into the hands of American consumers and proving they can stay competitive with big tech. DeepSeek may be the latest breakthrough from China to shock the U.S., but it won't be the last. And if the West refuses to tear down its own barriers to understanding China, the broligarchy will continue to be caught off guard.